Hey, my wild and crazy golden ear peeps, it is I, Lala, and now we are going to do my epic yays and nays for July. Now, I have a lot of yays, and I have new products to try for next month. I don't have a lot of nays, which is a good thing, because you spend a lot of money <laughs> getting these products. They don't work. Some you can take back, some you can't. It's hit and miss. All right, enough jibber-jabber. Let's get to it. Let's get started. I'm going to start with the nays because there are not very many of them. And once we get that out of the way, we can go to the real fun stuff. So I am not liking this stipling brush. I was going to try it and I did. And uh, it, it just, you still had to rub and get it around. I don't like the feel of brushes for makeup. So I'm still using my um, sponge. I, I think it just goes on better. So this is a nay. And then Maybelline Color, Color Sensational Lip Liner. I don't care for it. I think it's too soft. It's too fine a point. It just seems like it's, it's not uh, pigmented enough. So I won't throw that. City Beauty Lid Lifting Treatment. Not impressed with it. I mean, I think I'm getting more of a lift to my eyes and the crinkle, excuse me, it, from my new face that I use. And I mean, new face has just been the best as far as keeping me up, defying gravity. Now, I'm, I'm on the fence. This is kind of a nay. <laughs> uh, this It Bye Bye um, Under Eye Deep Puffing um, Serum. And I don't think it's any better than my... Um, Three ships, uh, eye masks, the ones that have red algae and avocado in them. Those are just, they're fantastic. And they just, I just put them on in the morning with my coffee. <sighs> and they're they are fabulous. I think that is all the nays. Okay, so right off the bat, I'm still loving. I can't say enough about this L'Oreal True Match. I did change my color up to N6. It's a neutral medium. I was light medium. Then uh, for the uh, Revlon Illuminance, this one has 5% uh, hyaluronic acid and squalene. This is just, they're just both so hydrating. Fabulous for mature skin. This is in color 401 Light Coffee. I have these new NYX lip liners. I've been using those a couple of weeks and so far I'm sold. They're Line Loud and I cannot, this is mauve, this is some kind of a hottie. And this is um, Trophy Life. But they are very creamy. I will link everything in the description below because they're very creamy and they're pigmented, so they're lovely that way. But uh, you have to sharpen them. That's, that's something I'm not liking. But overall, I absolutely love these. These are wonderful um, lip liners. And then NYX has a wonderful eyeliner that goes good on top and on your lip line. This is Deepest Brown. They're called NYX Professional Epic Wear. And this is in Deepest Brown, as I said, and, and they go on really nicely over the top and under. Now, they have to be sharpened as well, so I'm still using this wonderful little tiny thin brush. I can dip in to that, and then it makes a wonderful Wonderful, simple line you could, that you can thicken. It doesn't go on thick. It's always harder to get them off once you um, get them on thick. These are uh, Urban Decay, and the colors are hysterical. One's Mildew. That's the green one. The other one is Mushroom, and this one is Bourbon. These are really nice. They're, they don't go well on the uh, water line. They, they seem to come off, but they're great for on the top, and then maybe do a little corner on your lower line. I just had my eyebrows uh, filled in uh, last week by this wonderful woman here. I'm going to put her card up. If you're in Boise, it's Dr. Laura Reed. She's just, she does the eyebrows, the lips. She does the eyeliner. Just fabulous. So I can't thank thank her enough. So what I was getting to was that this Morphe has this wonderful um, retractable thing on this. It does have a little brush on here, but it's very pigmented and it goes on it's so easy. You know, I have a template. I still love this uh, Lancome tint. It's I've had this for quite a while and it's great for, I put it on my eyelids. I use um, primers on my eye. I just use 
the whatever concealer I have. The drugstore one that I'm really liking is Maybelline by Maybelline. This is a light, light color. And so when this runs out, I won't purchase it again because it's a large, it's a high ticket item and this works just as wonderfully. Those are my yays in makeup. Now, follow me to the bathroom where I will show you some skincare products and sunscreen. Okay, we're in the bathroom and I'm going to quickly go over my yays. This is the sunscreen, Aveeno Protect and Hydrate 60 SPF, water resistant and sweat resistant up to 80 minutes. It goes on lovely, smooth, soaks in beautifully. I love it and I'm not burning. I've been using this for a couple of months now, this Age Renew Retinol Body and Face Lotion. I don't use it on my face, but I'm noticing my skin is, is lightening up very ever so lightly <laughs> because that's retinol, so it's smoothing it. It's one of my favorite products. Oh, ooh, for the hair. I love this Sterling Silver Mask by AG. It's, it's an intense toning mask, so once a week I use that. I wash my hair and then I put this in for about three minutes. And then I do my follow by the Liquid Glass Smoothing Conditioner Dry Bar. This stuff is amazing. It keeps away the frizz. Your hair is smooth and soft, but you can still style it. It doesn't weigh it down. If you watch my morning and night skincare routines, you've seen that I am trying this It Confidence in a Cream. This is a day cream. It's like butter. It's anti-aging. It has niacinamide in it, hyaluronic acid, and ceramides. And then at night, I am using... It Beauty Sleep Confidence. This is just oh, got a little lavender scent. It's purple. It's, it is light too. It's just again another butter application, and it soaks in beautifully. Okay, I have a new product. I'm not sure about this. This is Revitalash Cosmetics Eyelash Conditioner. Now, another uh, YouTuber just swears that this is the best, that they've tried other um, eye conditioners and it hasn't worked. Um, my eyes, my eyelashes, especially my right, get kind of crinkly and um, curly. I, I don't know why. So I thought I'd give this a try, only because on Prime Day it was listed at, wait for it, $70. I think it's regularly $100 or $110. Okay. We're done in the bathroom. Time to go back into the YouTube studio. Hold on. Okie dokie, artichokey. We are back from the bathroom where I went over the skin care and body care and hair care. So I hope you enjoyed this. I hope that you will keep coming back. I hope you will like and subscribe. It's so, so helpful for my channel and to leave comments. So nothing is off the table. Whatever you would like me to do within reason, covering the beauty, the skin care and health, I'm all there for you. I'm here for you. All right, thank you again. I hope you have a wonderful day. Remember to wear your sunscreen, put on your hat, your sunglasses, grab a glass of wine if it's after five, and realize I'm probably doing exactly the same thing you are. See you soon.